9 o'clock, a mom is sharing her frustration after her four-year-old son was attacked by a dog near Oakhurst. Thanks for joining us. I'm Jonathan Cooper. And I'm Shannon Brousseau. The mom tells News on 6's Grant Stevens she is upset nothing is being done about the dog. Grant? Jonathan Shannon, she sure is. She says it's a tricky situation because no one's come forward to clearly claim ownership of the dog, and it also happened outside the nearest animal control's jurisdiction, leaving the mom to wonder who could do something about the dog. He walks up to me and his face is just covered. I can't even see Cover the tone of his skin. And his forehead's just laid wide open. Leon Ransom is just four years old. Like four or five? Four. Okay. Like any other kid, he's excited for his fifth birthday. But in his own words, he almost didn't make it there. Mommy. Um, Sunday. Mommy, I could have, I could have been dead. His mom, Jade Zoller, says Liam was invited to a birthday party on the 6th with several other kids at a house just west of Oakhurst. An adult comes running to me telling me, hey, Liam busted his head open. Liam went to the ER for surgery and stitches. Was it scary? The doggy got me. Days later, the dog is still there. <laughs> And Zoller says she hasn't got a clear answer on who owns it. I've gotten in touch of so many animal controls and so many shelters between Tulsa County and Creek County, and they just all keep giving me the runaround. The Sepulpa Animal Shelter calls this rural area a no man's land when it comes to animal control. It's too far outside their jurisdiction, leaving it to the Creek County Sheriff's Office. But the Sheriff's Office doesn't have an animal control department. At least they're not dead, Mom. Liam's right. The bright side is he made it out alive and is staying in good spirits. But with no one able to take the dog away, his mom worries about the next time someone's kid gets too close. Zollers told me a deputy did come to the hospital to take a report, and neighbors in the area told me that a deputy came to that house where it happened. So we know some form of investigation is underway, but Zollers is still wondering what happens next. Live in Sepulpa, Grant Stevens, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.